Might as well go ahead and get pissed off, but I'm gonna say it. If you think you can raise your child just as good alone than you can with a stable, productive partner, you're crazy. The data just doesn't show that. There are 19 and a half million children today living without one of their parents. Little girls who grow up without two parents are four times more likely to be teen mothers. Little boys who grow up without two parents are two times more likely to drop out of school. Nearly 100% of all rapists in jail today grew up in a single parent household. 80% of all individuals in substance abuse and addiction centers grew up in single parent households. A man and a woman together raising children is the most formidable team God ever created. Men are protectors, providers. Little boys and little girls need to see mentally and physically strong men who are good providers and protectors. Little boys and little girls need to be around women who are organized and caring. Both boys and girls need to see men and women working together, handling disagreement, working out problems. No, don't get it twisted. I'm not saying both parents need to be in the household 24 seven, but both parents need to be active participants in their children's life. It's quality over quantity. Little boys and little girls need to see how men treat women. And they also need to see how women are supposed to treat men. Cause there is a difference, you know. If you continue to raise your child alone without the support of a strong, competent partner, you've doomed your child to a life of poor education, low income, and substance abuse and addiction. I can't really tell you how to fix it, but what I do know is that you've seemed to find a way to find a partner to produce a child. So what you should do is spend the energy and time necessary to find a partner to help you raise the child. Maybe you're strung out on drugs. Maybe you've fallen on hard times. Maybe you skipped out on a visitation here or a visitation there, and sooner or later you've been three months, four months, six months, and haven't seen your kids. It happens. I see it all the time. And maybe you've been such a horrible parent, the court has told you to stay away. And if that's the case, then stay the hell away. Who knows what the reason? I'm sure you have one. It's all bullshit in the end, really. But the best thing you can do, get your ass up off the floor, pull your pants up, and do whatever you need to do to become an active parent. You'll feel better, and your kids will be far better off in life. Leave me a comment. 